ALM Octane increases developer productivity. Pipeline runs are instantly analyzed, helping teams to quickly manage and resolve failures. At the end of each pipeline run, jobs are auto-classified. Speed to initial analysis, code issue, test issue, environment issue, and so on. When tests fail, the build process doesn't stop. Instead, the focus is on the development team to take ownership of failures that their commits caused manage the failure. Failed tests are auto-classified to help development teams filter noise. Unstable tests are tagged together with continuously failing tests. All committers of the last pipeline run can be seen, including developers who took ownership of failed tests. When a build fails, emails are automatically sent to committers. To analyze each build failure, developers enter the failure analysis area. In this view, test fails can be managed. Key concept is for developers and test owners to take responsibility for failing tests. Failing builds are auto-tagged and can be filtered. Test failure age is tracked. LM Octane keeps historical information so that the first failure can be traced, including the commit that made the test initially fail. Problematic test tag is automatically added to tests helping developers understand if a test failed because of their commit or some other problem. Every committer can quickly filter test failures related to them. In the background, commits are auto-linked to failed tests. For each failed test, the list of related committers, also from previous commits in earlier builds, is presented by order of who is recommended to take ownership. Managing the failures is all about developers and testers taking ownership of failures. For that, a special field was added. Who's on it? Ownership can be easily tracked. Pipeline run trend. Trace failure trends and skipped test trends. Skipped means coverage changes that might need an immediate response for manual test execution in order to complete the coverage. The pipeline runs per job view of failed tests in each job over a filtered time period. Test run on environments can be viewed over a release timeline. Run trends can be viewed in a different view. Failure trend can be easily followed and compared to the overall automation suite coverage. Latest commits can be viewed per each user story with the auto tag of risky commits. Quality owners can focus on new content which might have quality issues. Risky commit information can also be aggregated to the feature level, providing a view of features that were recently developed, plus the risk factor. All pipelines traced by the workspace can also be viewed together, showing the overall pipeline status. File repositories are displayed in a heat map view, indicating repositories which tend to generate problems when commits are made to them. And finally, a rich out-of-the-box widget gallery with additional widgets. Developers can sort by failure age. And navigate to a historical pipeline run when this test failed for the first time.
seen indication of the current run and future runs of this test. Check the stack trace report, including custom build reports if they exist. See the commits that made the test fail for the first time. Custom build reports are presented side by side with the stack trace report.